Hello once again. Uh, a new session for editing files for voice attack or even for Star Citizen in combination with voice attack. What I want to show you today is how to cut music files and import um, yeah, a commando within your profile to run uh, music files during your play. Um, for the beginning, um, a recommendation for a program which is very easy to use when you want to cut down some music files to fit uh, within your voice attack profile. You don't need three minute or seven minute long uh, music files within a uh, vendor form swamp fight. Um, it's mostly you want to play a sound for it about two seconds till maybe 10 15 seconds. Um, so I recommend MP3 Direct Cut. This is a very easy to use program. It's a freeware. You can uh, use it without any expense. And just to show you where you may find it, um, I use Google and look for MP3 Direct Cut and you will find the website from the person who builds uh, this kind of software. Um, and you can download it directly from there, which is uh, this site. But I use normally uh, <coughs> chip.de, which is a German website, because it belongs to a computer magazine and it's a very safe download server. But you will get the German version from here. Maybe you will find an American download site, which uh, you trust in, to download uh, this program. Um, but let me show you the German uh, uh, site from chip.de um, and here you can see the software is freeware so it's without any expense and it's well rated so far and it's very easy as I told you before so these are the options to get a program which is uh, without any expense and easy to use and now I want to cut down an mp3 file to fit within my voice attack profile so I start the program and it looks like this and I import a music file as you maybe have seen my uh, full demonstration Star Citizen and Voice Attack uh, video you recognized uh, that I uh, give him a command to Voice Attack which was uh, Treffer which is the same in English like hit I did this after <coughs> I hit an enemy with a with a missile um, as a surprise but this uh, piece of music was very long so I'm not very glad with this and that's why I want to cut down this sequence now so I import it into my program and it looks like this um, you can here watch uh, the piece of music you imported and it gives you the actual uh, duration where you are at the moment and you also have it here on the on the bottom line. So what I want to do uh, when I start this one, the refrain will repeat for three times. But I only want the first piece of refrain to be uh, played after I hit someone with a rocket. And uh, this will be this part. I can give you a close inside look to the piece of music. So the refrain starts here to run the second time. So I want the piece of music which I use to be stopped here. And here. And here you can see a top down line which is uh, the marker line. And you can use this to position it at the uh, moment where the piece of music is cut down. And then you want to press down the left mouse button key. And then you want to slide it to the left or to the right. I want the right part to be cut off so I slide it to the right and release my left mouse button key and then you can see that this part is highlighted because it's a little bit uh, lighter than the other side. So I want to cut this piece out so I use the scissor. I click on it and the piece is cut out. So my piece of music is now 
only 7 seconds long and it's not 18 seconds like it was before. Um, this is what I want to use in the game now because it's shorter and it fits better to my profile. That's uh, why I want to click here and then I want to secure my piece of music completely. I hope uh, when you download it from an American website that it's maybe in English. Otherwise, if you download the German piece, you will find it here. This is uh, the only option menu you uh, want to use. So I set export and then I give a new name to it. Maybe I call it surprise new and I save it. Okay, that's all for now. I can close the program now. Within my folder structure I find my new piece of music now which is surprise now a uh, new and now come to the point where we put it inside voice attack um, just open your profile and make a new command or maybe you can edit uh, a command where you want to piece uh, put your piece of music at the beginning or maybe at the end but I will make a new command and my command will be I have to use a German word because otherwise he won't uh, recognize me. So I put him, give him a spoken command, and uh, then I open my window w over the button other, and I want to say play a sound. So I get this window, and now I need to show him where he may find the piece of music which he should play. So I take the new one, so press new, and I say open it, and now you have uh, the full folder structure where you may find uh, the piece of music but this only works for your profile you can't export uh, your profile and give it to your friend um, because it won't work as far as he didn't have uh, the mp3 uh, piece also and he has uh, this piece of mp3 within the same uh, structure like you have it <coughs> so this is mostly for you um, you can adjust the full volume here I will put it to 30% to have a good uh, sound overlay with in, uh, underlay in game, and then you can see while listening to the preview. That's okay so far. I press an OK, and I get my command within my command window. Play sound, the structure, and the piece of music which you should play on my command, which will be Treffa. So you can also put uh, this command at the end or at the beginning of uh, a macro command or then lots of commands. Maybe you want to lock on the missile on your enemy and uh, then you want to press the middle mouse button and maybe you say after I press the middle mouse button give me this piece of music while the missile is flying towards my enemy. This is just one option. Everything belongs to your creativity for the rest. Um, but this is how it should look like. Okay, let's give it a try. My command will be Treffer. Yeah, there we are. Everything is functioning. Um, Okay, this is a special command. Not everyone wants to uh, get annoyed by music while he's playing the computer game, but with uh, the adjusting of the volume, you can do it very decent in the background. Just give it a test, give it a try. Maybe you uh, want to um, make a command which is called music on, and you want to put a music file on on this command. Just try on your own. I hope you liked it anyway, and see you next time. Uh, back again with the, the video about music uh, in-game solutions. Um, I forgot something, so I want to show it you in addition. If you come along any problems playing uh, your mp3 files, um, I need to tell you that this only works if your Windows is also containing Windows Media Player version 10 and upwards. So normally Windows 7 comes out with the Windows Media Player um, version 10 and uh, the actual version is uh, number 12 so you normally have it on your computer um, if you don't have it on your computer uh, so the Windows Media Player at all you only can uh, work with WAV files um, maybe you need to install the Windows Media Player once more or you need to convert your music uh, 
data into WAV files. And there's a second edition. If you come along any problems uh, and your music music won't run, you need to make um, a change within Voice Attack. I will show it to you over the screw here. Please open the options menu, and then you will find this option Force DJC Audio. So when your music is not stop playing within the game, um, please demark this option. Um, I need to do this, and afterwards, uh, for me, it functions uh, very well. In the beginning, uh, it won't work for me as well, but uh, then I put off this uh, option here, Force Legacy Audio, and uh, in advance it functioned like I want it to be. <coughs> um, these both things uh, I just want to tell you before I close uh, this video. So, have fun and relax.